hi this is Sherry veronica now when they say that they have closed all of its u.s offices mcdonald's shuts down all of its u.s offices what does it mean what does it pretend where are they going to go from here where is burger king going to go from here kentucky fried chicken all those all those fast food joints where are they going to go from here if the distribution chain or if whoever is providing that meat source that chicken source when those people are disappearing and or maybe there's a directive maybe there was a directive that they could no longer supply humans with that particular low-grade product that they sold at these fast food restaurants who's to say what has happened but something did happen and mcdonald's ceo is saying it's going to be brutal when you know he starts this week this week april 3rd this monday there will be layoffs and it's going to be brutal. He's, it's not easy. It's going to be a lot. It's going to be significant. So is it that people are no longer turning into the drive-in area, the drive through area of these fast food restaurants? Is it that people are no longer wanting to work long hours since COVID it showed you? You can live. You can survive. You don't have to work as hard as you do. Is that it? Is that what has changed that a fast food joint or fast food joints that sold sandwiches and products very low key, very low priced, very, very low price. Sometimes you wonder how could they sell a burger for 35 cents? How did they sell a burger and make money with the bun, the cheese, the lettuce the tomato and the other top part of the bun and some lettuce not lettuce some uh, mustard and some mayonnaise and what how could they sell that for 35 cents and be okay with it what was it was it really meat was it really from a a cow what what is it that they give you between your that bun that they can sell to you for so cheaply i don't know I do not know, but what I'm saying is this is a good time to start to explore the things you do. Look at the things you do and maybe it's time to go back to the earth. Maybe it's time to to toil that soil. Turn it, just turn the soil in your backyard or if there's an empty space, just, just turn that soil and plant some stuff and, um, and plant your own food. Plant your own food because with these particular fast food joints, all of them, all of them all of a sudden going out of business, closing down, laying off people. What has changed? Who, who is the distributor that was providing that meat source or whatever source they were providing these joints? Have Where is that particular distributor and that provider? Where did it go? What has happened? Question everything. Question everything. And if possible if it's possible grow your food or at least know that when you go and buy a burger if they're not selling it to you for twenty dollars a, a, a yes burger if they're not selling it to you for like 18 between 18 to 20 dollars you don't know what you're eating you do not know what you're eating it's your veronica